The dawn of a new era, AI's arrival in medicine. Artificial intelligence is no longer science fiction. It's part of our daily lives, from navigation apps to online shopping. But in medicine, AI is about more than convenience. It's about health, safety, and lives. The potential for AI to transform how we discover, develop, and manufacture medicines is immense. Yet, with this power comes the responsibility to ensure these systems are safe and reliable. The pharmaceutical industry built on precision and trust is at a crossroads. Companies are using AI to predict equipment failures, detect defects and streamline supply chains, improving quality and reducing waste. But these advances introduce new risks. How do we know an AI model is making the right decisions every time? This is the challenge regulators are now tackling with the EU's draft guidance, Annex 22. Annex 22 is one of the first major regulatory frameworks for AI in pharmaceutical manufacturing, moving from general principles to concrete rules. Its goal, to ensure innovation doesn't come at the expense of patient safety. Understanding this guidance is essential for professionals and the public alike, as AI becomes central to the medicines we rely on. Decoding Annex 22 a new rulebook for pharmaceutical AI. Annex 22 is a proposed addition to the EU's Good Manufacturing Practice Guidelines, focused on AI and machine learning in pharma. It sets clear expectations for how these systems should be developed, validated, and used in production and quality control. The guidance mainly covers static AI MEL models, those that don't change in real time, like an AI system inspecting vials for cracks. It applies to manufacturing and quality control, but excludes continuously learning models and early-stage drug discovery for now. For years, the industry relied on Annex 11 and Chapter 4, but these weren't designed for AI's unique complexities. Annex 22 fills this gap, introducing requirements tailored to AI's probabilistic, data-driven nature. The draft is open for feedback, inviting industry experts to help refine the rules before they become law. This collaborative process aims to balance innovation with safety. For companies, now is the time to assess their AI initiatives and prepare for explicit regulation. Annex 22 marks the start of a new era in pharmaceutical quality assurance. The core pillars risk data and human oversight. Annex 22 is built on four principles. Risk-based control, data integrity, comprehensive documentation and human oversight. The risk-based approach means the level of validation depends on the model's impact on product quality and patient safety. Data integrity is critical. AI models are only as good as the data they're trained on. Companies must prove their data is accurate, complete and protected from tampering. Documentation now covers the entire AI lifecycle development rationale, training data architecture, validation and testing results. This transparency allows regulators and auditors to understand and trust the model. Human oversight remains essential. AI should support, not replace, human accountability. A qualified person must always be responsible for the AI's performance and able to intervene if needed. The ultimate responsibility for quality stays with humans, not algorithms. This ensures patient safety remains the top priority. Defining the mission intended use and acceptance criteria. Annex 22 requires a precise definition of each AI model's intended use before development begins. This includes a detailed technical specification, the task, required inputs, expected outputs, and the role of human oversight. Companies must clarify when and how humans will review or override AI decisions. Once intended use is set, clear, measurable acceptance criteria must be established often statistical metrics like accuracy or sensitivity. These benchmarks must be justified by risk assessment and set before validation to avoid bias. Validation then tests the model against independent data to prove it meets these criteria. Only models that pass this rigorous process can be used in production. This approach ensures AI operates safely and reliably within pharmaceutical manufacturing. The integrity of the testing process is a major focus of Annex 22, and it all begins with the test data. Test data must be completely independent from training data to prevent overfitting and ensure real-world reliability. It should represent the full range of conditions the model will face and be accurately labelled by experts. A formal test plan and thorough documentation are required. 
Annex 22 also demands explainability. Companies must be able to explain how and why an AI model makes its decisions. Explainable AI, XAI techniques help reveal which inputs influenced an outcome, building trust and aiding investigations. Models should provide confidence intervals so humans can focus on uncertain cases. This transparency makes oversight more effective and efficient. The regulatory oversight detailed in Annex 22 does not end once an AI model is validated and deployed. Companies must continuously monitor model performance in production, comparing predictions to real outcomes to detect issues like model drift. If performance declines, alerts trigger investigations and corrective actions. Any model updates, whether minor tweaks or major retraining, must follow strict change control and documentation procedures. Significant changes may require full revalidation to maintain compliance. When retiring a model, all data and documentation must be archived for future audits. This lifecycle management ensures AI systems remain controlled and reliable throughout their use. Annex 22 treats AI with the same rigor as any critical pharmaceutical component. The introduction of Annex 22 marks a significant paradigm shift from previous regulatory guidelines. Previous rules like Annex 11 and Chapter 4 weren't designed for AI's statistical, data-driven nature. Annex 22 introduces tailored validation strategies, requiring statistical metrics and independent test data. Explainability is now mandatory. Companies must interpret and justify AI decisions, not just validate outputs. Lifecycle monitoring and change control now apply directly to AI models and their data, not just software. Continuous monitoring for model drift and formal retraining procedures are new regulatory expectations. This approach recognizes that AI systems evolve and must remain under control from deployment to retirement. Annex 22 sets a new standard for transparency, accountability, and safety in pharmaceutical AI. It's a fundamental shift in how technology is governed in this critical industry. The release of the draft Annex 22 is a clear signal to the pharmaceutical industry the era of regulated AI is here. Proactive preparation is now a strategic necessity. Organizations must foster cross-functional teams, data scientists, manufacturing experts, IT and quality assurance to ensure compliance. Start documenting all AI use cases defining intended use, risks and acceptance criteria. Invest in explainable AI tools and train teams in data science and validation. Conduct internal audits to identify gaps in documentation, validation and lifecycle management. Early preparation builds institutional knowledge and confidence for regulatory inspections. Annex 22's principles, risk-based control, rigorous validation, explainability and lifecycle management are the blueprint for the future. The message is clear act now. Document your AI, define your criteria, and assemble your teams. Prepare for inspections and stay updated as the guidance evolves. By embracing these principles, organizations can unlock AI's potential while safeguarding patient safety.